Hello guys, how are you today? My name is Abdullah Zahwan from Indonesia and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to continue our previous video and in this video, we are going to set up drawer navigation. So let's open our previous project. So this is our previous project and to set up our drawer navigation, firstly, we need to create a new directories. Right click on lib and then we press package and we name our directory as helpers and inside this directories we need to create a new dot file and we name it as drawer navigation and inside this drawer navigation file we need to set stateful widget and we name it as drawer navigation and like the before we need to import material dot dot and we need to return container right here so because we want to make it to be full screen and inside this container we need to say child and we set it to drawer and inside this drawer we need to say child again and we set it to list view and inside our list view we set children and we say user accounts drawer headers and we see two parameters right here account name account email and for the account name we provide text widget right here and we say our name and for the account email we provide text widget again and let's say and to make our code to be beautiful we can press Control alt l and we need to provide another properties press Control space and we see current account pictures and we say circle avatar and we need to say background image and I want to set background image using network image so we need to provide image URL inside this and just provide URL inside our network image and after that we need to say decoration inside user accounts drawer header and we say box decoration and we set our color to be blue and let's run our app and we don't see anything because we haven't yet set drawer navigation so to do that we need to go to home screen and inside our scaffold below this app bar we say drawer and we set drawer navigation and it will automatically import drawer navigation let's run again and we see we have drawer and when we press this it will show us user account header we have circle avatar and then we have account name and account email this is just kind of like a dummy so the next step is we need to add another item using list style here so we back to our drawer navigation and below our list view we say not like this I think inside our list view we say list style and inside our list style we say title and we need to provide text widget right here and let's say home and hot reload and we see home and we want to provide icon on the left so we say leading and we say icon and inside that we say icon home hot reload again and we see right now we have icon after that we need to provide another properties let's say on tap and hot reload again so we can see on tap effect so we need to 
duplicate our list style paste below our first list style and we say categories and we change our icon to be view underscore list how to reload again and we see we have two item right here but it's a nothing when we tap on that so the next step is we want to make it to be navigate to another screen go to on tap properties and we say navigator of push and we use material page route and we set builder context and we want to go to home screen restart our app press this press home and it will go to home screen so duplicate this and implement to our categories and we change this to categories screen so we need to create a new file inside screen directories right click on there and that file and we say categories screen and we make it to stateful and we say categories screen and like the before we need to import material and we need to return text and we say welcome to categories screen and let's run our app again we see error because we haven't yet import our category screen just press import right here restart our app press this when we press home it will navigate to home screen and let's press categories and we see welcome to categories screen so that's enough my video today see you on the next video